Okay, so she killed Celeste. Ah! Previously, on remembered. I kind of feel so bad for her. Like she's been through hell, man. They can't be the same person. Same. Jennifer. Jen she looks like Celeste. Yeah. Oh, wait. Because like she's she's saying that that girl before doesn't look like this person. No. Don't bullshit. I was looking at that too. Is that like no? Nah. Jennifer's box. Is she maybe yeah. Uh, oh my god. What? Jennifer Richardson. Jennifer Richard Dean Felton. Birth certificate? I don't get it. Who's the last then? Split personality? Oh. <gasps> Unhealthy upbringing by deceased father. I was a disappointment to him. A oh my god, it's him! What's him? Dude, he's the fucking daughter I'm chasing us before. He's the daughter? Yeah. I once or twice refused to no. go through exams. No! That is not the father, that is this fucking... Is why he wouldn't go further through exams. That's him! That's they the girl. Understood. The old man is the girl. Jennifer or Celeste? Look, is it? growing daughter, and why he started calling her Jennifer. Oh. His name. Everything his father never wanted him to be. Oh my god. Jennifer. Right. Anybody here? Hey, Gloria? Is it Gloria? Oh I'm my here. god. No, no. I'm Don't trust her. Me. What on earth is going on? Be careful. There are Don't try. No, Gloria is one of them. Him. She's going to be the next stalker. Okay. No. <laughs> oh my god. Right Unless now. she dies. Unless she gets killed and she dies. Hey, what wait. do you think? Are you still here? I am. Stay calm. Please, don't leave me. Listen to me. Go to the infirmary on the first floor. I'm the only one who holds the key. We'll wait for the police to gather there. Okay. No, okay. wait here. Wait, in infirmary? Okay. Infirmary. Infirmary. What happened? Oh, Gloria, please oh. close the door. What's going on? Close this damn door. Oh, no. Shh. Don't. I can't believe. Oh my. Your heart is going no. to explode. No. Calm down, please. You have to take some. Uh, I don't have any idea what happened, but now you're making me anxious. Mr. Felton killed his wife, ripped her apart, but he still believes he killed his daughter. God, I can't, I, I can't, I can't believe it. You also knew? Of course I knew, but so he I killed her, right? never imagined. He killed his wife? That, and you didn't do anything? As his nurse, I knew how unorthodox and how inefficient they were, but that doesn't make me his accomplice. They'll be here any minute now. Damn. Is there anyone with Mr. Felton? Some kind See? of weird red nun. One from the page. She's the one who's yeah. here in the house. She's the nun. We have to stay here. Leaving now is out of the question. Wait. There are bars and the windows and doors. We're blocked. Here, oh my God, don't drink, drink it. This. Don't. This it's just to slow your heartbeat down. It's fucking green. Don't drink it. It's not surprising this happened. <laughs> well, she's been drugged. She's an idiot. Dr. Reed, what Gloria, are you doing? How did you get in? The doors and windows have too bars. late. We're trapped inside. <laughs> it's Until always now, the case. I've had your keys. The moment you start keys. drinking poison, everything becomes you clear. I them there on purpose until I found them. I know who you really are. <laughs> See? Now! Alright. See, I told you this whole time she missed. I missed! I literally missed. Ah! How'd she sing with her thumbs in her eye? Jesus. <laughs> Have you actually knocked her out? Oh my god. This should have been you. <laughs> Urgent hospitalization. The patient complains of a bad headache and a sudden but partial lack of sight. Later requesting hospitalization. No, she was. She is the patient. She's the patient. Diagnosis: the rapid worsening of the filamentary keratopathy, ice photosensitivity caused by the assumption of cortisone, and semi-permanent damages to the optical nerve. Damages that had caused an extreme eye photosensitivity. They're all going to die one by one. <laughs> What happened? Did she get hit in the head or did she just fall over? Yeah, she took too long to read and stuff. Wait, that's the cortisone. Remember how she dropped it? And it said cortisone? 
So that's what we're gonna use against her. We have to um put that into a syringe. So now we're gonna find a fucking syringe and inject it. Like. <laughs> Oh my god, she can't even stand up. How are we gonna face the red man? So really there's only two there's, there's only two stalkers in the house, right? The red, the red nun, this is Gloria. Yep. And the transgen. Okay, sorry, I think. The schizophrenic. Which makes sense because the, the red nun comes afterwards. And when she finds out that someone been who's in truth. Oh there we go the syringe. So as to who is the red nun? That lady Gloria. Ah. Right? Yeah, yeah. Alright, here we go, flashback. Oh, photo sensitivity. It's too bright. Why is she so slow? She's like, it's her. She's like saying it in a deep exorcist voice. Barge it. Okay, she's. I was supposed to get caught. Nah. Yeah, I was supposed to get caught. You're just hallucinating. Oh shit! Fucking Richard! Is it Richard? Jennifer? They really stick in the plot, didn't they? Come here. Who is my daughter Celeste for you? Is that him? <laughs> what? what the hell are you? No. No, no, impossible. Send her away. Some days when when my thoughts are clear. Fighting you. Are my daughters. But this horrible sensation of I am living everything again. Oh, my father back home. That forces me to dread, speak, live as Richard. I I thought I'd forgotten everything with time. So he's he's Jennifer. The it's actually more a Celeste grew, the more I remembered who I was. Who I could have been. So without knowing, I started calling her Jennifer. Mm, that sounds She liked it when I called her Jennifer. <laughs> and she left. Why did she come back? I would there's two voices because there's two of him. Once and for all. For me. For me. Oh my father. My father. Stop. Just shut up. I told you already. Stop talking or I'll cut your tongue off. Oh my gosh, she's trying to mesmerize us now. Yeah. Hiding in your pretty purse. You wanted to drug me, make me blind, right? Just like the old times. I loved you. I trusted you. You were one of us. But you I don't get it. deserve to be. Do you get it? No. Nope. I survived not once, but two times. Sorry. Ah. <laughs> You're not my sister anymore. Why does she keep calling us her sister? I don't know. 
Who doesn't live can't remember. What kind of life is it to suffer that way? You deserve peace. No, no, no. Mr. Felton, please don't listen to her! She is Jennifer. She is your daughter. She represents everything you couldn't have. It was taken from you. And now, she's in front of you. This is how you killed your wife, Mr. Felton! Listen to me. Don't listen you to her! the other times, but you I'm can't Rosemary. now. She can't we escape. this afternoon. You know how to do end. you remember? You know what you I, have to do. I gave you that picture. When you were a little girl, remember? I told you I could have helped you. Help you find a cure. Oh, no. Oh, Mr. Felton. Everything. No! Please. I beg you. Stop. What the hell? What? This is no, messed up. No. <laughs> uh, I thought he was gonna point at her, but he's pouring it on himself. <laughs> this is really messed up, right? So because he couldn't be Jennifer, because the father wanted him to be Richard. I can't focus, but go on. Right? He kinda like um was obsessed with Jennifer because he's Jennifer, he's schizophrenic mind, right? Yeah. So he made Celeste Jennifer because he thought that Celeste is Jennifer, right? Uh huh. So he thought his other personality was a real person, and that was Jennifer. Does that make sense? Oh, I failed. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so good at screwing things up. But does it make sense though? Kinda. Let's say the last bit again. Like, he... Fall backwards. Look at him go crazy with that. I was doing pretty well before, I don't know why I, I, I succeeded. Well, he's fucked. Or oh, she. He. But then we called her... Call... I'm so confused, guys. What? This is escape already, man. Wait, what happened to Mr. Felton or Jennifer? There he is. I mean, she is. He? She? Oh, yuck. Oh, yuck. Well, you know what that means. One less person to worry about. Yes. Now we've got a doorknob handle thingy. Which will help us defeat Gloria. What's that? Oh, her purse. Why, why is her purse just laying down? Oh, oh. wait, don't tell me that the freaking uh, witch, whatever you call that girl, didn't take the syringe out. Because that would have been really dumb. Because if I was a bad guy, I'd take the weapon away from the hero, right? It's too sus, man. Why, why would you just leave the place unattended in terms of like... Oh, I'm not sure Mr. Felton will like deal with her properly. I'm pretty sure she's waiting up there somewhere. You know, maybe she's trying to run out of the house. Because it burned down. Yeah, possibly. Get ready to do stuff. Wait, stand back a bit, man. You might get stabbed like last time. True, man. Oh my god. <laughs> Fuck, she wasn't even there to begin with. She just jumped out of nowhere. Hey! Oh. Did she get stabbed with what? The thing with the syringe. Is it? Yeah, she said that again. In her chest or face? Face. Don't get Stop me. saying that. Oh my god, that thing actually works pretty well. Wow. Yeah. Oh my god, hurry before she gets up from I the know, right? Hurry up. The ladder. Oh, you got this, you got this. We don't have an objective. Escape. This Left. is new. Oh. Alright. 
Run, run, run. Grab the chair so you can throw it. Oh wait, different game, sorry. No, no, chair, chair, chair. Knock him out. He's gonna come get you. Charge it. Uh, it is charged. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Was that a door? No. Yes, yeah, right. He yeah, has to be the right spot. Yeah. yeah. Oh my god. That wasn't too scary. Did <laughs> we just stab her again? Yeah. Suck. Did we just go back? I might just keep stabbing her. What's it say? Switch doesn't work. The short circuit. Resolve it. You're dead. You're dead. Can I stab her? Nah. Dude, that camera angle screwed me out. Oh, but nah. Close it. Oh my god, hurry. Ah! Okay, I didn't know what I was doing. Ew! <laughs> I mean, it's not—it's not pleasant to be hit by a brick. So, like, I'm pretty sure you knock someone out. Oh, <laughs> that just on <laughs> Nice. Just get stabbed through. I guess some more things to hit her with. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not scared. I need to hit her with a. I have to just keep running. The trap. <laughs> go, go, go. They're not letting me move. Dude, she's fucking angry, man. Whatever you've done to oh. piss her off, keep doing it. Stop talking. <laughs> I think you get oh, like, what drop was it. that? I don't know. Oh, oh, come on. I hate it. Whoa! Ass catching. We did it. I'm sure she can't get around there. there. I mean, if you can't see, there's no way she can possibly climb up. Oh my god. Wait, is she... How about you using the moss? Does she have powers or something? <laughs> that just happened. Alright, we get, get ready for a jump scares. <laughs> Cross backwards. <laughs> but she actually can't see, so it's fine. Was a wise one. I don't think you should... Did you have a brick with you though? I just think one. Well, how are you gonna fight her? I have a knife. I don't think it, it works. Shit. You're not supposed to get caught. Alright, come on, first try. Go five minutes. You killed the old man. Is She's running out of things to say. She said every fucking line she has for her character model. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't know what else to say. Why she sounds so old? Yeah, she was too close to me before. Right. She's blind. You blinded her. Wrong way, wrong way. Sure. Up the ladder, man, up the ladder. To your right. I can't see anything. Can I escape?
Left. Shit. Left. Right. Oh. Oh. Run, 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 run. I am. I am. Remember how there was that um green thing, the switch? Not this one. Remember the switch? Yeah, yeah. She's stuck. Mm. Get ready, eh? She's gonna grab you from behind again. Okay. Well, uh, right. There it is. I will make you regret your shit. Wow, that was easy. <laughs> this is a pain. Photo sensitivity. Is she gonna melt? Slice you up, bitch! So much vulgar in it. I'm guessing we feel bad for her now, I'm gonna save her. No. She looks like a normal distressed human. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No. She's gonna kill herself. Cut it out. To see. To know where you are hiding. Oh. It's painful. That's why she's just doing that. Stop. So now, there's no more pain. Doesn't make sense though. I feel like that would hurt more. So really fucking squishy up. eyeballs. Dude, I, I would not be able to do that to myself. Would you? I could stress my arm out and you. Push her over, man. Oh, she's gonna fall out the window, right? Yeah, she's gonna fall out the window. Yeah, I was gonna do that too. That's scary. So sad. Oh, that's crazy. That's so sad. I mean, I'm... I'm sure she was bad and stuff, but... It's pretty sad. That was messed up, man. Maybe, maybe all she wanted to do was just play hide and seek in the house with us. <laughs> no. Everyone there was just... Just too much blood involved, man. Well... Some things people will do for a game of hide and seek. <laughs> <laughs> so, you're still here. I How do you know it's us? Looking that great. Oh, this isn't how I want to die. I didn't want it to be like this. It's pretty messed up, game. Never have come here. It's all my fault. It would have happened anyway. They didn't give a damn about the disease. Disease? What they disease? They only used it to improve the phenoxyl. The moths were the final piece for the cure. And to show the world how much they were worth. The moths. They had noticed how moths were acting on Felton after he caught the disease in Egypt in 58. Man, she's like one tough lady, man. She's still alive. We were all test animals at the plantation. They used us. They made us believe we had been touched by the hand of God, giving us the disease as a sign. But then trouble came. The eyes burning, the bandage, the horrible pain in the head. All of this? To just forget. Phenoxyl was created as an antipsychotic drug for war veterans. Suffering from post-traumatic stress disorder. <sighs> to forget the horrors. As a father who ruined his daughter's life, forcing her to live as a man. Felton is just like all of us. He was a victim. He could only count on the results of the experiments of the plantation. When they withdrew the drug from the market because of its crazy side effects. Wyman, that fucking bastard. Synthesizing parasites and mixing them with the drug. 
Homie showed him he could do better. That it was possible to modify and control memories. Our memories. But we were only able to control the moths and peace. So yeah, she does have powers. Very sick. Seriously. And those damn memories will come up again sooner or later. Now I understand. Felton always told the truth. He just wanted to protect Celeste from all of this. From himself. From his Jennifer. He is Jennifer. The sessions were for her to just forget. This is what fucks me up. They keep referring everything for her. Felton as him and her. And he was the one yeah. who pushed her to leave. And eventually she did. She ran away. But I still have unanswered questions. And then she'll die before she answers. <laughs> it's not too late. This is not. Well, who are we to her, though? Yet. It may be the end of everything. And maybe we're already dead. And neither of us knows it. <laughs> I'm not the one who is crazy here. Maybe we both are. Maybe she's Gloria. <laughs> she's got schizophrenia as well. <laughs> you could have been one of us. No, I couldn't have. Yes, you could have, sister. But I could never forget that day. Oh, what day? The flames. <gasps> the, 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 the news article you in the uh, dining room. It's a sign of God. This was not a gift. This was not from God. It was fucking stupid science. And those two things have never been compatible. We believed it. It's true, and we were wrong. But you left us there to die. I, I don't. I, I don't know. I. I don't She's remember. She's had the Knoxville before. I can't well. remember. It's all confusing. I, I don't. It's over now. No. I don't want to die rotting in hatred. I've hated all my life. I don't care. So about. many words, but so little answers. It doesn't matter who you were, what we were. You are what you have become. Look at yourself. I'm nothing like this. This is all just farce, discount store garbage. Is she dead? Oh my god, she's still going. And I would lie on the grass. Oh, I love doing this. I would stay for hours staring at the emptiness and seeing myself somewhere else where I could go far away. And now all these memories hurt. Oh, that hurt so much. Why can't we just forget? Why? 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 Why do we have to remember? Because... That is how we save our memories from oblivion. She is still alive. You will find her. Yeah. I know you will find her on top of the world. What? Ooh. Celeste. If God is real, I hope he is made of this love. I hope you will Celeste is alive. I already have shit. Bad habit. Smoke. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> Is 
is something she picked up in the rubble. See, she picked the wrong thing up because she couldn't see. <laughs> she picked up the wrong fucking thing. Well, how is this going to help us? Oh, she went back <laughs> in the house. Oh. I mean, oh, there's no one else in the house I now. Know, but... Yeah. Yeah, I kind of wish she actually made it all the way back in. Like, I mean, it was all caged up, remember? Mm -hmm. <gasps> that was what it was. Maybe she can hear the music, because that was pretty in time and tune. Yeah. To hear hearts. To never... hearts. Two what? hearts never lonely. Was in the bag. What? See, that old lady find? is her. A goodbye. A goodbye that spoke of hope. Hope? Do you mean to say that, despite everything, she was not resigned to the idea of finding her? No. Not at all. She's like, I ain't doing that shit again. <laughs> oh, that's a really weird way for her tears to go. See, her tears went. <laughs> I don't get it. What was in the bag? I honestly don't care. <laughs> I've had, I've had enough. <laughs> Guys, thank you so much for sticking with us in this series. I felt like it, the game was tormenting me the whole time, man. It was tormenting Miguel more than I than me. I was just watching. But, like, but you were tormenting me. I feel like what this game has taught us is that you know sometimes you can be really pissed at someone for like doing something bad to you, but you just have to find forgiveness yeah. for them, right? It all comes down to making the right decision. And what that right decision is, it's completely up to you to figure out. <laughs> no, you know what I'm saying. Me too. The so guys, if you want to see more shit like this, make sure you hit the like button to show your support. And so you can subscribe to us so you can stay updated yeah. for new content. One question, which part was the scariest for you before we end? Hey, hey! Miguel? <gasps> Miguel Miguel! Who the hell has Miguel Miguel as a name? You! First and the last hey, name hey. is Miguel Miguel. Ramon Ramon. <laughs> 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 yep, my name's up there. Take that twice. Yeah. Look! Is it Miguel again? It's a Spanish game, that's why. Right? Italian. Italian? Italian? Yeah. Oh yeah, no shit. Well, let's find Ramon. Ah, uh, there we go. Ramon! <laughs> yes! We did it. Come on. Hey guys, thanks again for checking out that video. You can support the channel by liking it and subscribing. Until then, see you in the next one!